so many people came. It was amazing. Everybody loved the dude. This is such crap. Bianca. Why couldn't they save him? He was right there in the hospital. Why did he have to die? I guess Jesus wanted him close. What a stupid thing to say. Hey, Bex, do you have a ride to the reception? Uh, not yet. Why don't you come with me? Why do I always say the wrong thing? It's what you believe, isn't it? I should apologize. Tell him it was unfair he died. He was too young. You know what? You should leave it for today. You know what? I can't. I'm sorry about before. I was just looking for an answer, any answer, but there isn't one. What do you all know that I don't? He died because of you. Me? But I wasn't even there. You're the reason he went into the van. To call you and beg for your forgiveness. We should go. Your family's waiting. Listen, dude's a mess. Okay? He doesn't know what he's saying. I'll take you to the reception. Becky. Who doesn't? Undertakers, probably. Pretty much anyone in the funeral business, like cemeteries, headstone manufacturers. Okay, Connor, we get it. Is it wrong to say I miss Paris? What a way to end the summer. It's him, isn't it? So, should we head to the reception? Is that weird? We barely knew Adam. Yeah, but we can't just go on with our day like nothing happened, can we? Sweetie, what are you doing? I thought you'd be at the reception. No one wants to be there. But don't be silly. You were Adam's girlfriend. No, we had a fight. And I said I needed space. Well, that doesn't matter now. It does to Drew. You believe Adam's in heaven, right? Then you can talk to him whenever you want. Even say you're sorry. What are you thinking? Can any of you build a bonfire? How do you say goodbye to someone who changed your life? Beats me. But that funeral didn't do the trick. How was it? Funeral. Did Drew cry? It was quiet. But everybody was. Sounds like every funeral ever. Which is why I didn't feel like Adam. You know, he, he wasn't gloomy. He was the most positive person I know. And the ballsiest. <sighs> I hope everyone remembers him like that. Maybe we can help them. We're making a memorial video, aren't we? The best memorial video. Everyone's asking about you upstairs. I brought you some food. Egg salad, your favorite. Do you know what egg salad does to this guy? Drew doesn't fart. Yeah, keep telling yourself that. Hey, this is where the party's at. Wow, look at all the flowers. Looks like someone robbed a flower shop. Can you imagine? Hands up, Mr. Forrest. Give me all your gladiolas. Sorry, I'm not really good with this stuff. So, how, how, was, how was everyone's summer? Anything exciting happened? Hey, 
you right at his house, man. We'll go to a bar, we'll get some drinks, whatever you want. I just want to be alone. Oh, man, you got to be around people. Just need a song. Hey. I have some news that might brighten your day. I talked to the doctor. <laughs> your CT scan came back clean. What? <laughs> Seriously? Mm -hmm. Th that means you're cured, right? Not yet. I'm in remission. Which means the cancer is gone for now. So you can finally blow this popsicle stand, right? They're discharging her tonight. <laughs> you know, people would love to see you. They could use some good news. We need to get this place packed up. Can you talk to me? Anything you need, just say the word. I need brother back. He was the best, the very, very best. And I killed him. What? It was my fault. Now Becky's mine. I keep blaming everyone else, but it was me. It was the last person I talked to. If I would have just... planned a bonfire for him. It might help to go. Is that going to bring my brother back? Day. It's like he's watching over us. Okay, now for the finishing touch. Uh, Connor, can I have your help? Thanks. A little more. A little yeah. more. Yeah, okay. Who's that chair for? Adam. I think it's stupid, don't you? Stupid, no. A little creepy, maybe. What if this whole celebration was a mistake? I mean, what if no one comes? People will come. You posted the invitation on Facebook. Exactly, I posted it. Adam's friends don't like me. And Drew hates me. Drew lost his brother a couple days ago. Right now, he hates the world. I just want tonight to be perfect for Adam. Last hospital jello. Whoa. I thought you'd be ready for the bonfire. I've been thinking. Always scary. I shouldn't go to the bonfire. Why not? You've been discharged. I know, but I'm still immunosuppressed. Well, the doctor said it was fine, as long as there's no close contact. What about the hugging? You know that there will be hugging. I'll be your hug proxy. You want to honor Adam, don't you? You know I do. And what's with the string of excuses? Uh, 
Adam got me through this summer. How do I face everyone face Drew when I lived and he died? What kind of weirdo god math is that? You can't blame yourself for living. It's so unfair. I agree. But Adam wouldn't want us to be sad or angry or guilty. You don't know that. Would you? No. Anyone else really hungry? Well, obviously no one's coming. Let's just put the fire out and pack up. Wait, maybe we should No, it's off. fine. It was a silly idea anyway. Becky, just wanted this to be worthy of Adam. <laughs> Becky, can't we get this banner down? Not until you look over there. coming. It's gonna be a packed house. Or a packed field. This is exactly what people need. Reminds me of that party he threw for Fiona at the old church. It's where we finally sparked. <laughs> you called Adam a hero that night. Oh, that's because he was. Mine. Mm. He taught me the power of twinkly lights. Where would we be without them? Claire, you're here. I didn't think you'd no, make no, it. No, 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 no. Uh, um, no germs? You can hug the, the hug proxy. Me. Okay, this is weird. <laughs> They let you out of the hospital? My cancer's in remission. Oh my God. I didn't want to say because I didn't want to overshadow Adam. Are you kidding me? That's, that's amazing. Yeah, we needed some good news tonight. Now I just need to make sure that I make the most of my life. We all should. I've lived more than I ever thought I could. I went to Degrassi as a new person, myself, and I hit on the hottest girl, Bianca. Well, that was before my brother was with her. And then I fell for the perfect one who overcame so much to be with me. So hands off, Drew. Becky, come here. Come here, I want you on video. Then everyone can believe that someone like you would pick a guy like me. You like to off my camera so I can go make out with my girlfriend? <laughs> we always were just like birds in the sky.
what I was hoping for. I'm so lost without you. Hi, Adam Torres. I love you. How do we move on? We find a way to say goodbye. She did a stupid thing. When you love something or someone, you went after it, you didn't hesitate. So why you made such a huge mark on the people around you. Why there's so many people here to say goodbye. I'm not going to. Just to me, you'll never be gone. If you don't get another concussion. All right, guys, it's enough standing around. Let's get this party started.